Wow, that's so much lore here in the testing hallway. Yep, that's so much lore here. Yes, it is. Because now we're going to find Susseline. Susseline? Ah! Mm -mm. Oh, brother. Don't worry. I'm pretty sure she's not scary. Oh! Silly lost scaredy kids. Quick, in here! Do you think we could trust her? I'm not sure. Everyone, I want to all to welcome our newest students. You're late to class. I'm gonna slide this time since it's your first day, but be late again and have repeated pieces. You're, You're new, new and unpopular, unpopular students, students, so you will have to sit at the unpopular, unpopular table in the middle. middle. Now sit so we can begin. Okay. Okay, class, so the first lesson of the day is math. Over the course of the semester, you will learn how to annihilate others, how to safely extract the human brain for eating, and... Oh, wait, I made a mistake. I think that's lesson four of the day <laughs> for math. Over the course of the semester, you will learn to add, subtract, divide, multiply, and so much more. I am so excited. Before we start, let's revise some of the basics. What is 68741236126 plus 9819399912? And remember, wrong answers will be very harshly punished. <laughs> that surely is inconvenient. You guys have any calculator? Not sure. But this is ridiculous. <gasps> Maybe one of those recorders will help. Seven eight five six zero six three five two four. Correct. You kids are really paying attention today. Next question, and one that I wrote myself. What is two plus two? I got it. I got it. Four. Correct. Wow. I thought everyone would get it wrong. All right. Last question before your lunch break. What is misery plus disappointment? Hmm. My life? Correct. Unfortunately, that's all the time we have for math for the day. Go to your lunch break, and then we'll start the next lesson when you come back. Uh, okay. After this lunch break. Remember, guys, we had to be cool and get out of Bambolina's classroom. Right, so that way we can find Celine. Hey, you didn't see the person they're talking about, did you? Oh, what am I saying? You're all one, one of, of the, the cool, cool kids. kids. Of course you don't talk to ugly, unpopular kids like them. Take a seat with the cool kids where you belong. Okay. Okay, kids, the next lesson is science. Like we did for math, and since this is the first science lesson of the semester, it will only be a review lesson. But first, let me introduce you to our classroom rules. No eating, no talking, no breathing, no moving, no asking questions, and no washroom breaks. Remember, I will have to punish you very, very harshly if you break any of those rules. Back to the review. Let's start with something easy. How hot is the sun? My answer is, nothing as hot as me. <laughs> <laughs> I'll allow it, but only because it made me laugh and because you're a cool kid. I can tell by your very cool glasses. Next question. How many hearts does an octopus have? I should say, Stinger Flynn. Correct. Hmm. That's half right, since Stinger Flint is close to an octopus, he's a jellyfish. But I'll allow it, since you're a cool kid. Normal octopuses have three hearts. We humans have one. And Stinger Flint has... Um, I'm not sure actually, but let's move on. Next question. We have five senses. Sight, smell, taste, touch, and... Oh, maybe one of the quarters can help. Oh! Correct! Oh, 
You just made me use my fifth sense. <laughs> Close enough. I'll allow it. Unfortunately, that's all the time we have for science for today. Go on to your second break, and then we'll start the next lesson when it's over. Alrighty then. After the second break. I keep telling you guys we had to get out of Bambolina's classroom. Bambolina is really freaky. Oh, she certainly is. Because we had to get out of here. Oh, wow. Three All new kids, kids in one day? day? One of the kids? Yuck. One well, cool kids and one meat kids. kids. Welcome. Sit on the table to your left where you belong so we can begin. Uh, okay. Okay, kids. The next lesson is health and kindness. Just like we did for math and science, it will only be a review lesson. Let's start with some common knowledge to freshen your stupid brains. Can anyone here give me an example of an unkind person? Hmm. I will beat you to death. Correct. That is a perfect example. Good job. Assuming it wasn't directed at me, of course. Now, this time, can anyone give me an example of a kind person? I will give you immense pain. Correct. Exactly. Giving others things without expecting anything in return is exactly what kindness is.